The site of America's worst commercial nuclear accident is getting a second life. Or is that half-life? Pennsylvania's Three Mile Island Unit 2 reactor suffered a partial meltdown in March of 1979. Radiation was released into the environment, and the state's governor recommended an evacuation of pregnant women and children under age five. Probably the worst nuclear reactor accident to date. In addition to the fear and panic, and an ongoing question over health effects, the accident at TMI also effectively put the growth of nuclear power in the U.S. on ice. But that was almost 50 years ago. Now Microsoft wants to help restart Three Mile Island's functioning Unit 1 reactor to help power its data centers, used for artificial intelligence. AI is power hungry. According to the Lawrence Berkeley National Laboratory, 4.4% of all energy in the U.S. goes to power data centers, and that percentage is expected to keep rising. Three Mile Island's owner, Constellation Energy, says it can get the reactor up and running ahead of schedule by 2027. Constellation Energy President CEO Joe Dominguez says AI will be used to help operate the plant itself. You know, when we restart this plant, we're going to have some of the cutting edge AI technologies embedded in the plant so that we could take nuclear operations to a place never before seen. And while nuclear energy has its cheerleaders, like this former Miss America. When I say nuclear, you say energy. Nuclear! Energy! Nuclear! Energy! There are others who associate it with the accident at Three Mile Island. From a press conference in March of this year. I honestly believe Three Mile Island was everything we didn't need on how it was handled for us the survivors of it. I say, let it be a symbol of what should have never been and what should never be again. Constellation Energy says it's spending $1.6 billion to get Three Mile Island running again. The plant's reopening is subject to approval by the Nuclear Regulatory Commission.